Buona giornata and welcome to my channel. So uh, today we are going to be doing a Buff Bunny haul. I'm sorry, it's been a few days. I am finally an auntie. My sister had her baby like way early. So I will be doing, my next video will be a get ready and we'll be talking about that. But I wanted to hurry up and get this video out for you guys. I love doing Buff Bunny collection hauls, gym wear, really any type of hauls, but gym wear is one of my favorites. I am a trainer, so I wear gym wear a lot. So I got this stuff in a few days ago, but I didn't have time to shoot it. So today we are going to be going over sizing. Um, none of these were sent to me. I am, these are completely my thoughts. I paid my money for them. So let's go ahead and get into this video. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe down below. I really appreciate it. It lets me know that you guys like haul, so hit that like button. And let's go ahead and hop in. I was like, chop, hop in, jump in, all that good stuff. Okay, let's go. Okay, so just so you guys know, I am five feet tall. I weigh about 118 pounds, um, just for references. So I'll kind of talk about sizing and what I usually get and all that good stuff. So starting off, I have the Rosa crop top and the combat shorts. So the Rosa crop top, no, yeah, it is a Rosa crop top. I keep getting confused because these are crop tops. These are considered the bras. Um, this has no bra or anything like that. It is just a tank top. What I like about this is like, I've gotten the Aurora crop tops and those are one of my favorites, but they have a pretty high neckline. Whereas this one kind of comes down a little bit lower, like not super low, but I like that better. It is stretchy, so I size down an extra small, whereas the Aurora crop top, I usually get a size small in. Like I cannot fit into an extra small Rosa, like extra small Aurora crop top, unless I just have like boob pads in there, but I can't wear a sports bra underneath. Whereas this one, I can fit a sports bra but I got a size extra small because the Rosa material is very, very, very stretchy. And I would say if you are looking at the Rosa crop tops to, if you like a tighter fitting crop top to size down, only because the, I worked out in the black one. I got these in a few colors. I just love basic crop tops to wear to work. I can't really like, even these ones, I can wear these when I go to work, but I don't like to wear like a bra. I just feel like it's unprofessional. So when I'm training clients, I would rather have something like this. Um, but I did wear it to work out. And the thing is the straps do like five sides up, the straps would have driven me crazy, like falling down. So definitely with me getting an extra small, it helped keep the straps up where I wasn't constantly adjusting them or else it would drive me nuts. So I would say if you're thinking about sizing, then definitely go one size smaller than you normally would, unless you don't mind adjusting your straps and you're just going to wear it with jeans or, you know, make it kind of more of a lifestyle piece than a workout piece. But yeah, that is my opinion on this. One of the things I am happy about is like more of their stuff now is like in stock. Whereas like before it was kind of like things would just like fly as soon as you had to be. So everything I'm talking about is still in stock. So I would check it out on the website. Um, but yeah, I'm not an affiliate or anything like that. I just I love workout clothes so much. Um, and then the next piece is the combat shorts. So you guys will kind of see in the clip, these are really comfortable. Like I could just wear these around the house and be comfortable um, or more work out in shorts a lot because I don't want to shave. Okay, I'm a little bit lazy. If you pull these up too high, you will get camel toe, but if you wear them where they're supposed to be, they're totally fine. The only thing I will say is the waistband, it's very comfortable, but as you can see, it's not that like long. It's thick, but it's not long, so it doesn't dig or anything like that. Super comfortable. They remind me of like my husband's like boxer, boxer briefs, boxer shorts. I don't know, but <laughs> um, the one thing I will say though is if you carry a little bit more weight like in your belly, it is gonna show because this is not thick enough. It's not gonna hide a muffin top. So you will see a little bit underneath, especially if you're like squatting down or just like sitting there lifting weights. So if that's gonna make you uncomfortable, then just know that about these. I still really like them. Maybe I'll, I'll, I'll put in the effort and wear them to the gym. But I loved this like color so much that I got like every piece in this neon green. Like you guys know I'm obsessed with neons. And green hasn't really been a color that you see in a lot of different pieces. So I was very, very happy to get some neon green. But I got an extra small in these and then an extra small in the Rosa crop tops. All right, next up is the vibe set. So I, at first I was like, I don't want the bra. The bra for me, for some reason, looks a little bit less intense, but I think I'm just crazy. I don't know why. Um, but I actually quite like this bra. It is, I will say it's one of the higher support bras. I think it's called the Ambrosia bra. 
um, out of the Buff Bunny collection. Like usually, I will not put this on my face. I made sure to try this stuff on without foundation. Um, I was like, I'm not getting stuff on the shirts. But I really like this. It's super supportive where I actually feel like I could run in it. Um, most of the Buff Bunny's bras, I don't feel like I can actually like do high intensity workouts. Whereas like this one, I feel like it's a really good high support bra. I will say I got an extra small in the bras. Most bras now I do get an extra small in. I just take the padding out. Even though I don't feel like I have an extra small boobs, for some reason I just feel like the sizing is a little bit different on the bras and depending on what you like. I like tighter fitting workout clothes. I like to feel supported, you know? I want a boob flying out. So uh, this I would say is a really good like high impact bra. The only thing is like, I feel like you can't really wear this with a tank top. You know, it's kind of like you have to wear this as a sports bra as your shirt or else it's just gonna look weird. So I feel like that's that's the only thing about this is you have to kind of wear it as a top, you know, alone. And then matching that, I probably won't wear any of these neon green pieces together. I would rather wear like a white top and the leggings or this and black leggings, you know what I mean? Too much neon, I don't wanna look, I don't think this is too much, you know? But I also got an extra small in the leggings. Most leggings I do get an extra small in. And I really like these, these are the Vibe leggings. They have like the little mesh holes down the side. They kind of remind me a lot of like their laser sets, which I do really like. One thing I will note, like everything was squat proof in this haul. Um, but one thing I will note is like, these aren't as high waisted as they look on some people. Like lengthwise, these are perfect for me. They, I don't have any extra fabric. So if you're taller than me, they might go above the ankle. For me, they hit right at the ankle, which is perfect. I don't like crop, again, I wanna shave my legs all the time and worry about it, okay? But these kinda of hit right below the belly button, so they aren't like high, high waisted, and if you pull them up, same thing, like you will get camel toe in these. So if they sit where they're naturally supposed to fit, you'll be fine, but if you try to pull them up, you're gonna, you're gonna have a situation. So it's all up to you about what you're comfortable in, but they aren't super high rise. So just depending on what you like, like I'm going to show you against these ones. These are the new ones as well. I love these. I'm just like, do they say what they are? Um, but these are the ones with the mesh cutouts on the side. They are a lot like my cross my heart leggings. So if you have those, they are the exact same material, which I find these to be the most wearable ones out of everything. Like they're great for any workouts. They're squat proof. They're stretchy. Like I really, really love the material on the cross my heart and these new ones. But if you look at the vibe set compared to these, you can see like the seam comes down lower. So these are more high rise. So if you like something that fits right above your belly button, then I would definitely go with these. These are more high rise than these ones for sure. Just my two cents. So I kind of like the way that these fit better. I still really like these, but I like feeling a little bit more covered, you know, especially I ate a bowl of chili before I tied these on today. That was probably not my best choice, but I really like these. I will say these ones in the try and I wore underwear with, these ones I didn't. I feel like with the mesh cutouts, you really can't. Like you can try to hike them up, but you're probably gonna have them show. I am someone who likes to wear my undies when I work out. I just, I just feel more comfortable. Like what happens with girls? Like when I start sweating, I'm just like, oh no, I need the extra layer. Like I just feel gross. Like I just don't, I don't know. I lift heavy. I'm gonna say it. I'm scared I'm gonna pee and like I'd rather have the extra layer when I'm lifting heavy weights than be like, I don't have any underwear on this, like especially in this color, like that's gonna show through so easily. Like I'm not saying I pee my pants all the time, but the worry is there, it's in my mind. Like, so I would go with these if you like a higher rise. Um, and then the last thing is the Rosa bras. So the Rosa bras are by far my favorite item I think Buff Bunny has. So it is what I'm wearing right now. This is the hot pink color. I think it's just hot. And then this is the raspberry so you guys can see the difference. But I wear these to work. I feel like they are the perfect length where I'm not showing too much. Um, I adore these bras. I get them in a small though, not an extra small. It's the only bra where I'm like small is, is good. I don't want this to squeeze my back fit. So... I didn't, I don't think I went overboard this time. Usually I buy a lot, a lot. Um, they did come out with purses, like the game changer bag again. I know a lot of people were upset because they sold out so fast. I don't, it's a $96 bag. I just said I'm not really into bags. The pearl one looked really pretty, like that white color. 
but I was just kind of like, I don't, it wouldn't be something I would use that often just because I, I go to work and I have a fridge at work. So I just kind of already have my bag. I don't know. It was just more, it came down to cost. Like I was just kind of like, I would rather have workout clothes right now than a new purse. If I traveled a lot, I think that that would be an awesome option and it would be worth the money. But for me, I just knew that like, it wouldn't be worth it for what I personally need right now. Like maybe in the future, I will start traveling more. I would love that. Um, but the hot color, I love this hot color so much. Um, overall, I'm pretty happy with everything. Everything was squat proof as far as, I haven't had anything fall apart on me from Buff Bunny. I would definitely let you guys know. So I think the quality is there. Um, cellulite, obviously with the green color, especially because it is a lighter color, you are going to see it. So just be aware that the lighter color is like, yeah, you're, you're going to see it. Do I think you should care about that? No. Like I always tell people, like clients will be like, I'm too scared to go into the gym. And I'm like, no one cares what you're doing. Believe me, nobody is watching you. Everyone's there for themselves. Like unless it's a creeper, no one cares what you're doing. You know what I mean? So I don't think cellulite's a big deal, but just know their leggings are thinner. So you are going to see it. But the good thing is they're squat proof. So I'd rather, you know, it's give or take depending on what you're comfortable with. But yeah, overall, I feel like this this haul was like a good one. I enjoy all the products I got. I wasn't disappointed by anything. Um, so yeah, let me know if you guys picked up anything from the launch. If you have any questions, leave them down below. And yeah, I just, I'm nosy, so I want to know what you guys like. Make sure you hit that like button if you like Buff Bunny hauls. And so I know to keep doing them and other workout clothes you want me to try. I, I, I can always do that too. I can always spend money on those. So that is it for me. Please don't forget to subscribe before you leave. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.